records are very important tools to connect the future, the past, and the present. And without records, there will, there will be no way that uh, we can know who we are and uh, why, why we exist. All records tell a story. Um, and unfortunately, if you're not rich, if you're not popular, if you're not a politician, no one would really bother to keep information about you. In the Philippines, before you go to first grade, you have to have a birth certificate. That's one. When you go to high school, college, and when you have been there, these are all the papers required for your birth certificate and your wedding. What Family Search is doing, Family Search has been doing for many years, uh, is something that I really appreciate and I can really relate to because as a genealogist over the years I have realized that it is our duty as the descendants of people who have been dead many years, centuries even, to speak for them. little things that make up our identity as human beings and more are unfortunately left behind because look, they're not you know popular they're not Wikipedia type people back in 1965-67 within those two years uh, I met Mel Thatcher took me to the mountain in Utah and to the, where they, the Michael Films kept to explain to me what they were doing and why we were to Michael Films, the records in the Philippines. We had a contractor for a photo, which was excellent. The florals were excellent uh, contractors for us. And they, they believed in the work that we were doing, that it's, it's uh, important. And the microfilm, it's either a church records or a civil records and other records there are. I'm very thankful because it's been more than 20 years since that time and I continue to be helped by the records that uh, Family Search has preserved. So the Philippines is of a lot of interest um, to us because uh, they believed in the work that we were doing that it's uh, important and critical for the future. Six years before Yolanda, there was a place in Eastern Samar. I went there to negotiate the filming of the records, the municipal records. We placed the camera and do the microfilming. When Yolanda happened, the entire municipal building was washed away. After two weeks, I went back with the digital copy of the municipal record. And then I asked her, what happened to your records? And she said, can you see? We don't have office, we don't have even a building. So I said, ma'am, I have your record. So I showed to her one terabyte of records and the digital format. Is it true? So I said, of course. That's the purpose of preservation of records. The, the record keepers in the Philippines understood 
uh, the risks that records are at from typhoons, uh, fire, and local disturbances and so on. I hope the government will see that, you know, there's really nothing wrong with making records from the 1800s and even, you know, 100 years ago available to the public. And in the next 50 years, I hope what we can do first and foremost is organize the stakeholders of genealogy in the country and uh, find a voice so that we can advocate for what would be relevant to family history research. You know, again, without the, the, the preserved records which uh, Family Search did, I would not have known how my ancestors played a very important roles. We found out that most of our ancestors came from Bataan and my grandfather was actually a guerrilla. And within this blood was the blood of the hero here in Bataan. So I think it's very important to learn who you are, where you're from, what your grandparents, others have done in the past. So I think it's, it, uh, it helps identify who you are. It makes it real, just all the hardships they went through, etc. And I continue to grow as a human being, as a part of the human race, because of my love for genealogy. Something that a family would like to hold or like to discover is their own family tree. For the beginners, they thought maybe it's difficult, it's hard, it could be a struggle, of course, when there is no available records. But for those who have records, the system is very friendly, it's very easy to use, even in your comfort of your homes. Let's have the records of our life. Let's have the records of our family. Let's preserve the records, whatever you have the records, let's preserve it. This work needs to be done as quickly as possible. It needs to be given um, ample attention by all the stakeholders because genealogical records are important to, to link um, ourselves with those that have come before us and the, the following generations that will come after ours. Electronic preservation is one of the, the best preservation, but we need to be in a hurry in doing it. I did use it and I did know that it's easy. New generations will eventually need all the copies that we're digitizing right now. And also they, they will need that as their reference on what happened during the past. We will not be who we are today if not for those who came before us. And the only way for us to honor them is to find out who they were, how they lived, and what they have given us to date. All of these um, databases, all of these things actually can uncover so much about our past, so much about our families, and so much about our history as a people. And uh, I hope that uh, the people will benefit uh, from uh, the work that we've done I know this, that uh, the records are in a safe place. I, I hope to be able to see that um, government and you know, the Catholic Church and the other churches in the Philippines work together to preserve um, these records for the generations to come. When everybody will be doing this job and we will be connected to each other, we'll be linked to each other, Actually, we are building one family, one big family. I believe that the branches of the future are rooted in the past. Without the past, there will be no future. That's why we need to know the past. I speak for the dead because I want to make sure that everyone, not just the famous popular people, that all may be remembered.
We preserve records so that all may be remembered. We preserve records so that all may be remembered. We preserve records so that all may be remembered. We preserve so that all may be remembered. We join together as we do this so we'll become one and we will be united and all will be remembered.